My name is Doko Fore and I am an author, I am an entrepreneur, I am a public speaker, an international public speaker and I was born in a refugee camp in Uganda. I believe being born in the refugee camp helped me to develop a genuine sense of appreciation for life because we didn't have a lot of materialistic things but we had the ability to see life um, for what it could be. When we came to Australia, everything was so completely different for me because we went from a place where 99% of the people looked like me, spoke the same language, to, to eating the same food, to a place where people didn't look like me. They didn't eat, you know, they didn't eat the same food and they didn't speak the same language. And as a result, there were times where I was bullied and because I was also born with a speech impediment, I found it very challenging to adapt to the new environment but at the same time there were some people who helped me along the way to get to where I am and I believe as long as you want to do something and you want to become better there, there are always people who will be able to help you one thing I believe is that what you went through doesn't define you and I went from where I was to where I am now by meeting and learning from different individuals working on my speaking ability and at the same time wanting to help people because I believe if you genuinely want to help people, it doesn't matter what you do, you can become a better version of yourself. And luckily for me, that has gotten me from a kid who was born in a refugee camp with a speech impediment to being able to help people through my speaking ability and being able to provide for my family. The achievement which I am very proud of with everything I've done is the fact that after everything, I am still genuinely happy. I believe Brisbane is the city of dreams and the citizens are the dreamers. That's also why the ancestors of this land have been dreaming for thousands and thousands of years. And the other people like us, like ourselves who came from different places, are just joining you know, the indigenous um, community of this country to continue with the spirit of dreaming. And it doesn't matter where you come from, it doesn't matter what color you are, what language you speak or what, what kind of food you eat. One thing that unites us is the fact that we all have dreams. Our dreams are all different, but that's what makes it beautiful. Being someone who is also a business owner, I know the challenges and the headaches, uh, the nights where you are not sleeping and fatigue that you get. But for Brisbane to have a venue, a place where you can actually come and seek for help, learn from other individuals and meet your potential clients at it, I think that's something which everyone should utilize.